What's going on, guys? It's your boy Wad here, and today we're back for the episode of Bleach Brave Souls, guys. And in today's episode, there's a bunch of shit we're gonna be talking about. So uh, let's first start by collecting our ten orbs for today. And guys, tomorrow we get our guaranteed five star ticket. Save it, save it. I'm going to stream tomorrow, guys. I'm gonna stream tomorrow around 2 p.m. and I want to open the ticket with all of you guys. I want to do a group. Huge group summon. You guys all send me what you got, and then uh, uh, via Twitter, and I will put it all in like one little montage and just post like a bunch of pictures of what everybody got with everyone's like username in it. And I think it's gonna be cool to see the different variety. Who pulls what more? Who pulls this? Who pulls that? So please, guys, save your tickets. Let's all pull together live tomorrow, and uh, it's gonna be so fun. So here we go. We got one Brave Souls ticket for today too. So taking a look at the news, guys. I didn't talk about this the other day. Um, sorry about the sniffles. It always happens in the morning when I wake up. I, I don't when I wake up. I don't know. It just it happens. So uh, we, we got this new love event. I'm sure I talked about it, but I've already beaten it uh, 40 times to get the one Hogyoku I needed from it, and it just drops a new love. It, it's a new blue love that I'm working on maxing out to get my orbs back up. But VL is done, guys, as well. That is another update for you guys. And the main reason why I wanted to make this video was, in fact, um, to show you guys the new characters that came out. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So we got three new characters coming to Bleach Bracelets, guys, to the Japanese servers. Let me show you guys in the book. I know Calman made a video on it, but like I said, guys, I can't put out videos right when they come out. It's late for me. I was sleeping way before that. I, I actually started to sleep a lot earlier now. I'm in bed by... 12.30 to 1 the latest. I used to stay up to like 4 a.m., but just not good anymore. So, wow, I haven't even seen VL since I've maxed him. Okay, so if we scroll down, guys, you can see we have a new 4-star Mashiro, 4-star Love, and 4-star Rose, guys. We have the freaking Visards. They finally got a fucking new 5-star and a new 6-star. Their old one was shit. Was shit. They all had 4-stars. Um... Let me think. Yeah, they all had four stars. They've never had a five star before, and it's about time. But, guys, I'm so confused now. Where does that leave us? They dipped into the full bring arc, and now they're going back to the visored arc. Or, unless these are the visors from the full bring arc, but I, I don't remember seeing visors in the full bring arc, so. They're kind of going a step back, so I'm wondering, is next month, or at the end of the month, is it going to be like Lisa, um, uh, Lisa Hachigen and someone else, or is it going to stay the same and just these characters are going to be middle of the month characters, and at the end of the month, we're always going to get full bring. I don't know. You guys think these are just going to be fillers, and at the end of the month, we're, we're going to keep getting full bring, or are they going to start giving us these at the end of the month now? What do you guys think is going to happen? Let me know your thoughts on what K-Lab's doing. Uh, you guys are all getting... Um, uh, you guys aren't even getting this this uh, this gacha. You guys are getting Murumasa, which is sick. Um, Murumasa, let me show you. Where, where are they? They came out a while ago for us, but there's Koga, Muramasa, and Kazushini. Those are amazing units, guys. I highly suggest summoning on it. I'm actually farming a bit on Global to summon on this banner so I can bring you guys a video because these are really good units. I am... I love Muramasa. I love... He's one of my favorite, if not my favorite L or heart type character to use. He's a fucking beast, man. Even though it's showing he's level 100 here, he is a beast, man. At 6 star... This man is a monster, guys. He is a monster. Like, ah, I, I love my Mudamasa. So, I would highly suggest going for it, but we're going to hop over to the PC, and we are going to be taking a look at the new characters with their six-star stats, guys. Yes, they have just released right now. I might have been first for the actual characters, but at least I can look at stats pretty early on with you guys. So, let's take a look at some stats. All right, we'll start off with Mashiro Geek. And, uh, like, what a sick picture. Of course, you can tell by a Mashiro kick because it's an explosive kick, but it's still sick. So, there's Mashiro right there on the screen. Her background picture looks amazing. This is her six star stats, guys. So, at six star, um, because that's, that's really what matters. Even though their five star stats are cool, their six star stats are where you're going to see them mostly because you're going to evolve them to six star. This is where they're going to shine out. So, that's why I don't really go over five star stats. But, um, this is crazy, guys. So, she has. 
775 stamina, 592 attack, and I'm sure she's going to be fast, 283 defense, 265 focus, and 536 SP. She needs um, focus jewels, as you guys can see right here, which is pretty easy to get. Um, she has 20% down, which means she has 20% damage reduction. That's fucked. That's the first of its kind, 20%. Now the limit is, uh, so 16, 16, 32 plus 20, 52% damage reduction. You can reduce your damage by half now. Unless you throw it on her. If you throw it on her, guys, that's, I think that's, uh, let's see, 16 plus 16, 32 plus 16, 48 plus 20, that's 68% damage reduction on Mashido. So if you think her stats aren't that good, she could have 68% damage reduction. What? What? Okay, moving on. She's a speed attribute as well, so she's like, move over, Dungini. Um, so she needs four-star Mashidos and four-star Kennys. Let's actually translate to what her six-star abilities are. So she gets emergency avoidance plus one, um, normal attack power up plus 30%, wow. Double strong attack, so she has frenzy, amazing, wow, with 536 SP. The, the range of her death blows goes up and the range of her normal attacks goes up and the soul trait requirement is the buff from 16% uh, damage reduction to 20, which is unreal. Uh, as you can see, she's a full melee character. Our first melee, it's 592, 592, 592, then 710, so it's a four hit combo. Um, she has her first melee attack, her second melee attack, and her third melee attack. And then she has her special, which I believe, I believe will do burn damage, guys. If I am not mistaken. And she is on the first page. So she's right under Rangiku and Baragon. So she's, she's a character. She's not a character to take lightly. Ah, uh, okay. We can't click on that anymore. So that's Long White South, aka <laughs> uh, Mashiro. So that's fucking sick. I'm super pumped about her. Um, let me know what you guys think down below. What do you guys think? Actually, wait till the end of the video. See all three characters, and then we'll we'll assume genders. Um, so next, I don't know. I don't know why I mix up. Next, we have Rose. We have the lovely Rose, and um, I don't know. I always mix some him in love, but we have Rose right here, and he is unreal. So he has twenty percent strong attack up. Um, I assume that strong attack damage. Yes, he has seven hundred and seventy nine stamina, five hundred and fifty four attack. 299 defense. It seems like all these characters have very high defense. 253 focus, which is good. He's going to be critting a good amount. And two or 548 SP, which is unreal. It's like every character now has the perfect balance of SP and attack. Like there's never one that has like significantly more. It's always a perfect balance. And he's a red. He's a power character, which is sick. The guitar, I'm sure, is going to come in handy with his moves, guys. I'm sure it is. Um, so he has 150 defense crystals which is a mate oh no this is uh yeah defense crystal which is unreal guy that's so much better man that's so easy for everybody and that's just amazing like defense is the easiest crystal to acquire if you're a farmer like i am it's so easy to get defense crystals so he has emergency avoidance plus one shocker normal attack power up plus 30 percent strong attack power up plus 30 percent death blow power up plus 30 percent the range of death blow goes up plus 20 and he gets defense reduction uh, as his ultimate. So as a five star, he doesn't have the defense uh, reduction or defense like reducer, but he does get it as a six star. So, um, oh, he gets it on top of paralysis. Wow, that's fucking sick. So he has five, 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 four times three, then six, six, five for melee damage. His first strong attack is a melee attack and it has a 2% probability to paralyze and 2% and it lasts two seconds. Um, his second strong attack is as well a, a oh, you know what, it could, it, okay, it could honestly be anything. It says melee damage, so it's a melee attack, but we don't know how it's gonna play out. It's gonna inflict paralysis as well, 2% chance, and same with his ultimate. And uh, his ultimate has a guaranteed 5%, um, the guaranteed 100% chance, sorry, it's early, to inflict Paralysis damage and it lasts around five seconds and I'm sure you get the damage um, Reduction on top of it as well, which is sick. And I meant to say third strong attack over here, but I fucked up But love he's gonna be or Rose, sorry. He's gonna be so cool to check out I can't wait till the test plays come out or the gameplay is probably gonna come out tonight So you guys will see one of those gameplay reactions because I know you guys love seeing those 
So we'll probably do one of those. And last but not least, we have love. We have the love. Oh my god, look how sick the animation looks. The fucking picture just looks unreal. So let's translate. He has normal attack up plus 20%. Um, I had six star. He has a technique as well. And at six star, he has 799 stamina, which is almost like 800. Oh, shocker. But it's that's actually really good. 594 attack, which is amazing as well. 293 defense, which is still very high. 239 focus, which is really good. And 515 SP. This is one of the characters where it's kind of a big difference, but 515 is still significantly high for SP. Um, unfortunately, he needs stamina jewel, so I hope I don't get this one as much as I would want him. Green. And stamina, not for me, not for me. I don't have those type of jewels to just throw away at a character, even though he is very cool. So take a look at his six star stats, um, his abilities. He gets emergency avoidance. He gets the strong attack powers will rise plus 30. He gets normal attack powers will rise plus 40. Normal attack range will rise plus 20. Death blow number hits increase plus one. So he gets bombardment and he gets normal attack speed plus 15 guys. And of course, from the picture, you can assume he does do burn damage, guys. So it's a three, it's a four hit combo, 594 times three, then 713. He has three melee attacks, each with the probability of inflicting burn 2% chance that lasts two seconds, which is like 16k health. Um, if you really do it on bosses, like it, it, it comes in handy the two seconds. It's fucking crazy. And his alt, of course, is 100% probability that lasts five seconds, guys. But so a really cool character. This is a really shocking banner, guys, because none of us really expected this to drop. Um, I, at least I did not expect this to drop. Uh, it's really cool, though. Uh, I, want, I want you guys to let me know what your favorite characters are, uh, which ones you guys like the most. I'm going to switch back just to our video. But I want you guys to let me know which one you like the most um, because I personally would love Mashiro um, just because... I know she's going to be a beast, and I need some good melee blue. As you guys can see, I do have some decent physical blue cards. I did get Holly Bell. Actually, I didn't even... I forgot about Holly Bell. Actually, I might not need... I don't really need any of them. I really don't. So, we'll see if we're going to pull them or not, because I really want to save for the end of the month, because I want to get that new Kenny, and uh, I won't have enough to summon this gacha and next gacha. Orbs are hard, guys. Orbs are hard to get. I don't know how you guys are killing it. I do have a few more characters to max out, like, a good amount, but still, it's going to take time, so... I don't know if I'm going to summon on this gacha. We'll see. You guys let me know. What do you guys want to see? And, um, yeah, as you guys can see, I have Suzumu Bachi and Halle Bell. They're, like, my main blues. I have Yushido, who's uh, range. I do have Grimjow, but, as you guys know, as sexy as he is, he's a little bit outdated. Um, but, yeah, guys, I got some characters to max out. Uh, I got some four stars, too. So, it should be a grindy next few days, but uh, we should get it done, guys. So, if you guys enjoy, let me know who you're most excited about. Um, I'm going to try to get you guys another video out later today. I will try. If not tomorrow, I will have my new video out. It's a good one, guys. So stay tuned. Love you guys so much. Hope you enjoy. Smash that like button, guys. Let's see if we can get 500 likes on this video. And uh, let's, freaking, let's freaking do a group summon tomorrow, guys. Group summon. Save your tickets for me, and it'll be sick. So I love you guys. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.